Welcome back to the Loganites. <laughs> I'm whimpering, Carl, at and the sign of that dog. And I'm moaning, Malcolm. Ma- nearly headless. <laughs> Gonna be nearly headless. Oh, jeez. Did you notice we have a map of this place and it's huge? Yeah. Yeah, I did. What did you do last time? I don't know. Wait. <laughs> the controller starts to rumble occasionally. Okay. Oh, wait. oh right here. Oh. See, this is what I thought we were going to have to do, but then it just randomly uh-huh. <laughs> was just done. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, I'm so there full of anxiety and oh, farts. Gosh. Oh <laughs> Can you scan even though your buddy's not with you? No, I mean scan. Okay. Okay, that's a bad guy. They don't have anything to loot. That's a bad guy, Malcolm. Don't kid yourself. You get jump up and twist your knickers. <laughs> Yes. So you must be pretty good. Well, perhaps we, <laughs> we come from a long line of survivors. Uh, sorry, I should explain. There are security monitors and speakers in walls. I'm Peter Knight, junior doctor to the royal household. So don't worry, you're not going mad. <laughs> uh, well, um, <laughs> do come and find me in the lab, won't you? In the what? The lounge? The lab. The lab. That makes way more sense. <laughs> Meet the royal doc. This can only be good. Yeah, it can only be good. He's been experimenting with solutions, and he's and he's mad. And that's that's the foreshadowing. He's a he's a doctor. He's he's a zombie, but he found out how to make himself not be uh, <laughs> mute. I think he's just trying to find a cure no matter the cost, and he's lost his soul along the way. Yeah, I agree. I'm getting rid of all these guys. Thank you. <laughs> Ooh, carbon you... Yeah. Oh. God save the queen. And the nudes. <laughs> uh, I'm scared. Retina scanner? Need security clearance. Um, excuse me, Peter. You were supposed to let me in. <laughs> oh. Oh wait, that's the. That's the way to go. Oh my gosh. I'm so scared of this guy that just. Yeah. To me. Yeah. Although, why am I more scared of him than the guy that's been talking to me the whole time, right? Yeah, or just the zombies that actually want to kill you. <laughs> yeah. You just exploring now. Well, I just. Well, I guess that's the way to go, huh? Uh-huh. It tells you which floor it's oh on. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Did I hear something? Oh, hey, the bathroom. I could use that right about now. Oh. Oh, stop. No, don't go in here. Why? All kinds of bad ideas. This is like a feeding frenzy for a horror movie. It's oh, locked? It's, it's occupied. Oh, look. Oh my gosh. My heart just pounded a little more. <gasps> Did you hear that? Oh no. Yes. Shut up, this chap. He couldn't handle the, the horror, you see. Then again, maybe he was more sensible than the rest of us. Oh. You have cameras in the bathroom. That's nice. Yeah. Okay, that was a scary room, but we survived. <laughs> We're good. <laughs> I gotta take a deep breath. How do other people do this? I don't know. And this is like, I feel like this is relatively not a scary. It's game. not that <laughs> scary, but gosh dang, can I not handle it? I know. Just, just go to the marker. This way. Okay. Yeah, I don't want to build the world anymore. <laughs> Sorry, I know these corridors are a labyrinth, but well, 
That's the point. You just need to keep intruders out. I suppose I should warn you. There are also a few infected running around in here. Used to be a name of soldiers, you see. Huh. So they're still infected. Yeah, he's saying there's a, there's a few around here, to be perfectly honest. Probably that he's experimenting on. Trying to cure. Nope, not that way. Nope. <laughs> nope. <laughs> because it sounds scary? Yeah. Oh, uh, yep. Yeah. Hello, housekeeping. Well. L1's chained up, isn't it? They're in a. They're, they're in, in a, a cage. cage. Okay. Well, see you guys. Oh, hey, this must be the lab. Close the door behind you. Do make yourself at home, but please don't touch anything. This is all vital scientific work. Yep, we called it. Close the door behind you, just a precaution. Yep, it's closed. Sorry, I can't greet you in person. It's safer for both of us, you understand. I'm researching a cure for this terrible infection. You <laughs> see, it's slow going, as I have so few subjects to test on. Uh-huh. Like those poor Omega Group soldiers. Not my finest hour, I fear. If you'll forgive me for a moment, I'm sure you can help me. Maybe we should read some of those newspapers. Queen's letters. Taking those. Yeah, can you read the yeah, newspapers? Yeah, let's 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 look into that. Um newspapers. Scholars warn of a four hundred year old prophecy. No blight in blighty. From Royal Guard shot by his own men. Former Royal Guard. Well, that's all. Queen's to, letters. Uh, open. Oh. Wait, can we open the other ones? Oh, shoot. I didn't want to do it. Can we open the papers? Yeah. Open info. Oh, gosh. Uh, I don't want to read all that. Let's just do the Queen's letter. Okay. Uh. Open it up. From the office of Professor Keating, the Master Fellow of the College of the Great Hall University, August 18th, 2004. Oh, I thought it was the Majesty speaking. Oh, well. Oh. <laughs> your Majesty, following your request of the previous confiscation on the matter, I have undertaken a brief study of the so-called Black Prophecy of John Do D. John D, not John Doe. <laughs> While fascinating in historical context, the undoubtedly powerful in this remittery, an intellectual cross-charge. I must conclude that the prophecy and its correlating interest in the pan panacea. panacea are little more than that. D was a devout and intellectual man, but also a scholar of alchemy and her hermeticism, her hermeticism, and was co as was common in the time. For therefore he believed himself to be regularly visible. Visited by angels and demons with whom he conversed. The, the black prophecy is the result of one such conversation as resulted in Dee's volume in Enoch's Colloquia. The book is quite rare and many extended copies are just suspected to be forgeries, but the Balodians has held a copy since 1640, just 30 years after Dee's death, and I am quite sure of its provenance. Dee's fascination with the Pantheia like derives from his obsession with the Great Plague, as he encountered many cases during the European travels, and of his own wife succumbed toward the end of G's life. Oh, geez. I would suggest this vision is a recreation... Reaction. No. <laughs> <laughs> reaction to a man known as the expert physician when faced with such traumatic and incurable circumstances. Hmm. Sounds like the guy in the next room, doesn't it? Yeah. In modern times, uh, bubonic plagues, <laughs> as it's known, quantifiable and curable disease. Wait. In modern times, bubonic plague is a known, quantifiable, and curable disease. 
By contrast, in the 16th century, the only cure was to burn the corpses. So as the stem of disease spread, as of course occurred in the Great Fire of London. In summary, what I admire and welcome your majesty's interest in the patronage and medical research and care for the nation, I must conclude that there is no cause for alarm with regards to the predicted blight, nor indeed for undue optim optimism concerning the panacea. Humbly yours, I remain William Kating. Kate Kate Kating. Well, okay then. So, Burn the bodies. Got it. So, well, it sounds like... Let's go listen to the doctor for a little bit. <clears throat> well, what it sounds like is uh, he did research on a guy who pretty much thought the bubonic plague was the zombie apocalypse. And so their only solution was to burn the bodies, which... Can, can you open that? Is what it is. Oh! I say, steady on, Uncle. So he's basically just saying, there will be a cure for this. Uh-huh. Can you open that? No, it's, it's locked. locked. Can I open this Can one? you get rid of some of his subjects? Nope, that one's locked. Now here's how you could help. Okay, here's how we help. Derimbedi Secreti by Conrad Gessner. Fascinating text, but what I'm after is Dee's own copy where he made annotations. I believe it's in the palace library, which means going upstairs, I'm afraid. Okay. So I gotta go. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Elevator can take you up to the palace. Okay. Do we have a new... We have our heading. Yeah. <laughs> so we're going to head upstairs into the palace to next the library. time. Next time. On the Luganets. Luganets? Bye-bye. Bye-bye.